as a business leader, you know what it's like. You, you give money, if you're spending money, you give with one hand, you take from the other. And what we have seen in today's budget is an extraordinary amount of spending uh, to support businesses in the pandemic. Do you think it's enough? No, I don't think it's enough. Um, and there's a huge difference between spending on the economy and investing in the future. And I think uh, Rishi could have done a lot more to invest in the future. That said, I think it was a very smart budget. I think a lot of his measures to be extremely applauded. He just needed to do more. And I am concerned about the 25% hike in corporation tax because we have to attract inward investment. And one of the ways of attracting inward investment is low taxation. So whether that 25% will hinder the inward investment um, approach, I don't really know. But if it does, he will have to find other ways of attracting businesses to our shores to create jobs. I am incidentally very disappointed that he hasn't supported excluding. I, I don't understand why, because there are very, very clear uh, arguments as to why many of these people should be helped. Um, just some of the schemes offered to businesses, like the, the Kickstart scheme, are you happy with, with those sort of schemes? No, I'm not at all. I, um, I think Rishi's lost a real opportunity here because we're going to have hundreds of thousands of young people out of work. And what we desperately need is huge investment into world-class class apprenticeship schemes that last from three to five years, sponsored with various uh, world-leading companies within the UK okay. to give those youngsters a real career a real inspiration and a real set of skills okay. to help make Britain great.